Hi guys, welcome back to my vlog series Indian Life German Way and today I'm making this video um, just because I have received my new Osmo Mobile 3 gimbal set I recently ordered it and the reason I'm making this video is just to talk about what are the different features it has and most importantly how, um, how much it costs and why I have chosen this uh, in comparison to the latest model which is DJI Osmo Mobile 4 or and they have shortened this to OM4 so let's first start with the unboxing of this device and uh, let's see what all it has to offer so uh, some of you already know that I started with my YouTube vlogging like one month back and I was just trying to figure out, um, I was just reading a lot of stuff, watching a lot of videos on YouTube, how to make your um, channel, yeah, how, how to basically stand out from, from the competition, right? Uh, because when you're making YouTube videos with your phone, it's not really possible um, or sometimes it's, it's really difficult to capture the videos or the videography in, in the right way. And one of the key techniques um, to, to master that is, is using a gimbal. Uh, it, is all, it is also known as a stabilizer that lets you control, offers a lot of functions with, in, the, in the palm of your hand and then of course you are able to record motion, uh, videos without a lot of disturbances. Yeah? So you are able to uh, make videos which are much more steady and offer a lot of other options while you are on the go and making videos. So I have the box open now. Here it is. Oh, it looks so amazing. I think it only comes in a standard color. Uh, so it has a lot of features here. As you can see, place to hold your mobile. And then you have some functions here and here. So you can basically do a lot of stuff using your fingers and your thumb and it has also a button right here which has multiple functions so, we, so this is what i got as as my first item let's see what else we have here oh so we have here box i think it might be the charger yeah so here we have Okay, so this is a carry bag that you normally get uh, when you order it. So here is my Osmo bag and charging cable and of course a manual. So along with that, I have also ordered um, a stand a tripod because it's it's very important because when I'll be making videos I need to be able to place it like this on the on the stand yeah so I will open it so here is my tripod or stand for my Osmo mobile 3 as you can see so I can basically place my sit on top of this. Yep. Okay guys, so now I want to talk about the reasons why I bought this 
as compared to the latest version so my reason number one this device is best for beginners because it offers all of the maximum features which are already available in the latest version so it has features like um, toggle control so you can toggle you can control your toggle from here it has a joystick it has an option to uh, you can switch your camera back and forth um, it has a sport mode which would allow you to record videos while you are playing sports or doing running or whatever sports you might be playing apart from that it also uh, comes um, with a with a very user friendly app the app is easy to download you can download it from app store or from android phones it's available and it lets you uh, explore more options so my second reason why I chose this uh, device again is, is because it is it is cheap. Um, it is less expensive as compared to the latest version. So I bought this device for 80 euros and the tripod costed me 20 euros. So in total I paid 100 euros wherein if you buy the latest model, model you end up paying um, 150 euros. So considering you are a newcomer in this field, you are new to making YouTube videos or you are in the process of learning videography. Uh, using your mobile phones then I think this is the best place to start where it is econ economy economical and you also get uh, value for money and you get maximum features which are already available in the latest version option number three or the reason number three uh, the other important reason which is very important for me is the auto focus feature so it offers a very unique very important feature um, and it's it's really important when you're filming videos uh, by yourself so you don't have a friend or you don't have somebody who can hold the camera and and, and you, you know so and you can understand that it's not really easy to move from one place to another because your camera is pointing at you so the auto focus feature would allow uh, would make um, you as an object so this device would make you as an object and basically it will track you so it's it's like a motion sensor yeah? so if you're moving from a point to b point and then the camera would automatically move um, with, with that and then of course if you're alone you can make uh, much uh, descriptive videos you can use the background that is that is available to you you can you can use the width of the area you are in because you can travel basically from here to here and while talking and then of course the camera keeps on moving and it will always record you so i think it's um, one of the very cool features that's available with with this device and also with the latest version and reason number four guys is that this device is best uh, to be used for mobile phones or cameras that weigh up to 220 grams so this device can support 220 grams and for me i'm personally using an iphone 11 pro which weighs around 190 grams and i think that's uh, that's very easily supported by this device and the reason why i'm talking about the weight uh, it's it's a very important factor because um when your phone is heavy and you use it you have really problems balancing uh, your phone here and if it's not balanced then you of course you cannot make videos right and um, so balancing is again one of the critical factors which is important while you're using these devices gimbal or stabilizers and one of the uh, so when you I should also highlight this that when you are considering buying a Osmo Mobile 4 and why it is better being the latest version is that of course it has a it offers a very good uh, balancing um, option as compared to this this device here but of course if your phone is uh, is within the weight limit of this device which is 220 grams then you are good to go using this device as well so these are my top top four reasons why I think I would prefer to use this device as a beginner and what it has to offer you so uh, i hope it, it the video makes sense to you and i'm able to help you in some way so guys uh, if you really like my video please share your feedback in the comment section um i'm not be as so basically i'm not going in detail on the various functionalities because i would also like to explore that uh, myself and then probably i will make a video um in, in the next weeks or months on that topic but um I hope you like my content, you like the video, please share your feedback and um, yeah, 
thanks for thanks for joining me please if you like the video please consider uh, liking and subscribing it and wish you good luck thank you bye